What's up you guys? Eddie at Fliptronics. We're going to be checking out the Moto G6 versus iPhone 10 in a gaming comparison. So I've got two great games picked out. We've got Tekken and then we're going to do Into the Dead 2. These are two of the highest graphic games out there so I think it's a good way to showcase you know both phones. There is a huge price difference though in these phones. We're talking about like 250 bucks up here versus like a thousand down here. And I gotta say, like, you know, the G6 has been very impressive. The only downside is load times can be a little bit long on these games, but other than that, everything is pretty smooth, so I can't really say uh, anything bad about it. Uh, for those of you who have not played Tekken, I mean, you absolutely gotta check this game out. It's my uh, favorite fighting game of the year, for sure, and, you know, it's also... You know, one of my favorite fighting games of all time. You know, back to the days of, uh, you know, PlayStation and just, like, literally, you know, the arcade. This is always one of the best fighting games alongside, like, Mortal Kombat and, you know, Virtual Fighter way back in the day. Anyways, got a little bit of a KO right there. So we'll get into another match and then we'll head down to the iPhone 10. But, you know, this game's excellent. There's also over 40 different characters you can unlock in it as well. Um, let me know what you're thinking, too, as you're watching this as far as, like, how... You know how the performance is, you know, with both phones, what you guys think, and, uh, you know, I really haven't seen too much lag on the G6 on these games. Like I said, it's really just load times, you know, getting them loaded up. So other than that, I mean, it's been pretty good. All right, Nina's taking this dude out. Oh, dang, get that combo. Wow, we got a perfect score there. All right, so I'm going to head down here. Let's, uh, you know, get some iPhone 10 gameplay in. I'm a lot farther in this game on here because I've just put a lot more work in. But, you know, let's get into some of it here. I'm going to use Steve the Boxer for a match right now. We'll go Steve on Steve. Uh, obviously, we're going to have a better picture, you know, on here on the iPhone 10. Plus, it's going to load these games faster, obviously, too. But, you know, uh, it's just hard to hard to complain when you're talking about, like, Wow, I'm really getting killed here. This is pretty bad. All right, this is not looking good for me. Literally, like, one more hit and I'm dead here. Probably need, like, a miracle at this point. Wow. Yeah, I figured I was going to get KO. All right, so I'll load up a different character, but that was pretty, pretty bad match on my part. I guess Kazoo is going to have to take this dude out. This guy's blocking it. There we go. Finally, I was like, what? how is this guy blocking every punch I'm throwing at him? All right, so we'll get into another match here, but, you know, um, let's see who we got over here. We'll go against the, uh, the punk. Let's take the punk out. Ooh, that was a nice little kick. Oh, take that punk down. Oh, that was great, great counter attack right there in midair. That was awesome. Okay, uh, so anyways, yeah, I mean, clearly I love playing, you know, games on the iPhone 10 as you can see on the channel. So, uh, you know, picture quality obviously going to be a lot better. Uh, you know, speed performance a lot better, but, you know, you can kind of just see that the G6 still really, you know, held its own there. So the next game we're going to be getting into is Into the Dead 2. This is definitely one of my all-time, you know, favorite, uh, you know, zombie games as far as, like, first-person shooters go. It's a constant shooting game. There's tons of levels. Uh, you know, there's a great campaign. There's also, like, a survival mode on it as well. But here is where you can kind of see low times take a little bit on some of these games for the G6 above. Uh, literally, I mean... You know, games, you can hop into them right away on the iPhone 10, but, you know, especially these bigger file games and these high graphic games, they take a little bit longer to load up on the G6. But, like I said, it's hard to complain when you're talking about, like, 
such a budget phone. I mean, this phone literally is uh, very affordable, 250 bucks. All right, so we'll kick things off again with the G6 above. Um, get into a quick run right here. Let's grab our guns and, you know, let's kill some zombies because that's what it's all about, right? line these phones up perfect um if you want to check either of these phones out i will also have links in the description you can also hit me up in the comments if you have any questions about you know either of them obviously uh you know i'll get back to you oh let's get that double kill oh yeah double kill again thank you very much Let's get to that ammo crate. All right, so this game is literally just all about not running out of bullets. I mean, you you really got to try to conserve ammo. Sometimes it's hard to do. I mean, if you just want to kill a bunch of zombies, sometimes it's like, oh, you know, crap, I ran out of ammo. But, you know, you really want to do that. You can unlock all kinds of guns in this game. You know, there's uh, AK-47s, assault rifles, submachine guns, all that good stuff. So, I mean ton of different guns you can unlock and you know this game is very realistic these zombies are pretty freaky I mean they do look very real I mean it's a very eerie game but I mean it's awesome this is just one of the best zombie games out there oh, can I make that ammo crate oh yeah I got it oh I love getting those double kills Probably shouldn't have gone this way. All right, that was kind of a risky move I made at the end there. I could have easily gotten attacked. Okay, so anyways, there you go. You got some G6 game plan into the dead too. Just awesome, and uh, we'll kick things off down here and uh, you know get into some of the iPhone 10 gameplay. Um, but yeah, I mean, obviously you can see the game played really well up here again. You know, it's a very high graphic game, and it looked really good too. So we'll kick things off down here. Hey, pumpkin. What's up? Oh man, I love getting those double kills. Had a little trouble with the truck, so uh, I'm gonna be a little late. You look after your hand for me, okay? I'll be there soon. I love you, sweetie. I love you too, Daddy. Dang, I'm just whipping these zombies. Killing my ammo, though. Ah, oh, missed that ammo crate. That was stupid. Man, there's just nothing better than killing some zombies. Okay, uh, there we go. So, like I was saying, um, I mean, the G6, I mean, it's it's a very impressive phone for like a $250 phone. Putting up against the iPhone 10 is a little bit unfair. Obviously, this phone is going to have a much better picture on it. It's going to run games smoother, uh, and it's going to load them faster, but... With that said, uh, you know, we checked out really two high graphic games up here. We had Into the Dead 2, uh, you know, Tekken. I thought the G6 really held its own. Like I said, I thought it was very impressive. The phone has been very impressive so far. Um, if you guys like this video, I definitely appreciate if you hit that like and share button below. Like I said, if you have any questions or comments or any thoughts on, you know, what, what you thought about the comparison, you know, hit me up in the comments. Uh, thanks for watching it, and we'll see you all later.